Hey guys, it's Paul. So just real quick, I wanted to make a video because I got this awesome care package from Gym Tech Accessories. Uh, I don't know if you guys sort of know about it, but basically they started out as like a playback company and now they make just all kinds of accessories. I've actually gotten some stuff from them in the past. This is the, the icon, but this is a backpack. And inside of the backpack, they sent along a couple of other really nice things. So first things first, I'll just sort of show the outside of the bag real quick. It's got a component, a component, a compartment. And here you can unzip, you could keep like, I guess, um, business cards, random stray things could be in there. Got another one here. You can, uh, I don't know how well this shows up on camera, but yeah, lots of places to keep stuff. There's actually a locking system, which I think is really cool. And yeah, if you're into backpacks, this is really cool. This actually seems like the type of bag that somebody like Larry would love, because Larry likes bringing a lot of deck boxes with him. Um, I'm kind of more of a minimalist, so I'll probably end up letting him hold on to it, but I will show you what's inside. So, well, first of all, the outermost component, um, I think there's three compartments here. No, wait, there's only two. Okay, so we've got all this. This is yet another place you can keep stuff. It's reminds me of like my bags I had back when I was in school. Um, this is where all the deck boxes would go. And I think that it was really genius of them to kind of have this uh, part that zips over it. So you can have lots of deck boxes and they won't fall out. I've seen different um, bags sort of just have like straps over this, but I feel like deck boxes can still go all over the place. And speaking of deck boxes, so they sent over two of their coolest, most recent deck boxes. This has Godzilla on it. I just want to say that's incredible. Um, and when you open it up, we have this full design. This is, um, who is it that Godzilla's fighting? That you, is King Ghidorah. That, okay, King Ghidorah. I yeah, think there's Alec more Neo. going on in the art than just him. I've already shown everybody in like the APS group message this image and everybody loves the Godzilla one. Um, but also, well, before I show this, I, I already have a deck in here. You don't have to guess what it is, but I just threw a deck in, wanted to do all that. This is actually divided into like separate compartments, which I think is genius. And this part here flaps out, and this is where you can keep your dice. So if you like having Yu-Gi-Oh dice and everything on you, it condenses down really nicely, and I like it. Uh, I also like the material in this. Now, this is um, another deck box, the Senpai deck box. Now, this is one that, you know, some people really love it, some people really hate it. I honestly think it's fine, but I heard that people, uh, that you can't use it at Konami-sanctioned events or something. I'm not sure what that's entirely about. But the inside design might tell you why. Now, I know some of you guys will love this. I'm actually not like a huge sort of anime waifu person, so this doesn't do as much for me actually as the other one does. But that said, it's a really nice deck box and the color is really cool and it works just like the other one. You can keep dice and other things inside. So these have two different materials. I'm not good at describing materials. So I'll just say that I like this material a little more but I think that it's really a matter of taste. I don't think that they're bad. They actually seem like they're built really well, but I'll have to put them through their paces. Anyway, though, um, that was really cool. And the last thing, let's just keep these out, huh? The last thing that I think is super duper awesome and really inspired, wait, I feel like I'm doing this wrong. This is why I can't have big backpacks, because I'm bad at this, um, is this. Book of Moon based, um, it's just called the Bintec Moon, I believe, binder. So it's got the design of Book of Moon. It's actually got this really cool, like, sort of foil texturing, which makes it, you know, I don't know if that kind of shows up, but it, uh, that's cool. I, don't, I feel like I've never seen a, a binder do this. I've seen kind of like etched in designs, because you can't tell this isn't like drawn on, it's actually etched. There's like surface and like texture to it. It's like embossed, I guess is the word for that, but this is really cool and it's blue and actually the inside is also blue. These blue pages might not seem like a big deal. Ooh, I like that microfiber, nice little texture. These blue pages might not seem like a big deal, but so many binders just default to like black pages or maybe white pages. So this kind of makes it feel a little different. You get to fill this up, I just got it today, but really cool. So all in all, a bunch of really nice things that they decided to send over. So shout outs to Jim. Um, I'll actually link all of this stuff in the video description. Shout outs to Brandon specifically. He's the guy who sent it. Um, you'll know who it is if you follow them. 
And yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. I thought it was really cool. So that's it. Uh, subscribe or something. Bye.